and I'll still think that action films specifically, even from the 70s and 80s, they reflect a certain time and a certain experience of the people. But what I wanted to explore was a woman in a very macho genre. A participant of this workshop, a filmmaking workshop in Moel Fun, but they used to work in, in the action film industry. So you would even see the goons of those action films hang out in, in Moel Fun after class. And so my friend and I wondered what is it about the action film industry that still makes them look like their characters. So they would have brushed up hair, a big buckle, sometimes boots, and the way they talk feels like they're, they're coming from an action flick. So I guess it's more of a reflection on how cinema has an impact or affects us as people. And it started there, but it's also a film about an existential crisis. So I've always wanted it to sort of reflect the times. And I also think that action films specifically, even from the 70s and 80s, they reflect a certain time and a certain experience of the people. But what I wanted to explore was a woman in a very macho genre. Because in, in these hundreds of Filipino films in the past, they would just be about bloodshed and killing all the bad guys, fights and shootouts. But in, in this film, I wanted to see how problems can be solved in a tender manner. And so in this film, she's in an action film, but the way she solves problems is not through killing people, but to making them understand that they are human as well. Everything is, is a surprise, it's a bonus, it's a gift, and I'm super grateful because even when we were pitching this film, people really didn't, and I wouldn't say understand, but they didn't like the project too much just because it sounded too complicated and ambitious. Making the film was a process of learning. Editing was a process of learning, and now even screening it is a, a grander process of learning as well. And so yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy slash inspired because in traveling also I've met a lot of people who have smaller budgets than ours and whose films are amazing. <laughs>